It's Friday night in Hallettsville, roughly 100 miles southeast of Austin. And there's another packed house to watch Brema's football. Small town, football, high school, Friday nights are a blast. It's not officially homecoming, but tonight they're welcoming home one of their own. Jonathan has always been very special to us in Hallettsville. This is where it all began for UT star running back Jonathan Brooks. This community is fired up beyond belief about John Brooks. I guarantee you everybody's glued to that TV every time he gets on the field. During his senior season, Brooks scored 70 touchdowns and led Hallettsville to a state runner-up finish, their deepest playoff run in school history. That's why when former head coach Tommy Pensick retired, he wanted something else retired with him, Brooks' number 25 jersey. It means a lot just to know that like me and my brother wore that number, so it feels special that I could do it for him as well. Brooks's jersey was officially retired at halftime Friday night. Special for so many reasons. But bittersweet for one, his late father Skip couldn't be there to see it. My father, he'll be really happy because this is probably everything he's wanted just to see me succeed. So just knowing that he's up there smiling. Skip, who died on March 28, 2022, is the inspiration behind Brooks's touchdown celebration. It's a quick tap of the tattoo on his right arm. It features Roman numerals of the day Skip passed. It's very cool. I know he would be very proud. He's very happy, and um, I wish he could see him. I wish he could see him starting at UT. That's what his dream was, too, so that's really cool. Jonathan Brooks is now living that dream during this breakout season. And it's a handoff, Brooks up the middle. First down and more. JB, say goodnight to this one. Jonathan Brooks, 54 yards for a Texas Longhorn touchdown. He's top five nationally in rushing yards halfway through the regular season. After two years backing up now NFL running backs, B. John Robinson and Roshan Johnson, his patience is finally paying off. It's just gratifying, it, you know, he, he finally made it, you know, it, he did have such good patience and I'm uh, you know, proud of him, glad he didn't try to go anywhere else and so very exciting. He sat behind two guys and really paid attention and, and listened and learned and his style of play now has grown even as the season's gone on. He's a physical runner, we know we can count on him at the most difficult moments and that he's going to come through. <laughs> And back home in Hallettsville, the Bramas are beaming with pride. The people are fired up. It doesn't matter if you're old or young. And their hometown hero won't forget the community that raised him. They mean everything. They are the reason that I'm kind of here today. Uh, the support they gave me. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.